uh, my CVT score was 800. Uh, even the paper was not that difficult, if I may say. It's like antonyms, synonyms and all. Uh, the goal of writing CVT as well as the board exam all together. Because since our portions are similar or it's the same, it's very easy for us to handle both of them. We don't have to learn extra. For political science, sociology and psychology, it was basic NCRT books. And I believe they are the Bibles for all these subjects. The examination preparation before boards or after? Hi everybody, today we have with us Aksa. Would you briefly introduce yourself? Yeah, sure. My name is Aksa Marne Ibrahim. Uh, I'm from Kerala. Uh, my CVT score was 800 and my I, I studied in CBSE board. So my CBSE board exam scores were 99.2 questions. Uh, I'm currently at LSR, Lady Sri Ram College in the University of Delhi. And I'm pursuing my psychology on That's wonderful. 800 out of 800. Uh, let's start from basics. Why did you choose CUET examination? Uh, the first reason is it's University of Delhi. I've always wanted to be in DU and I was having a plan of scoring pretty well in my board exams and then making it into DU. But as the CUET came in board, I thought, yes, I have to give CUET to that. That was the basic reason and the only reason. Okay, what was your subject combination? Uh, for CUET, it was English because it's a compulsory language. Then it was psychology, political science and sociology. Okay, we are talking about an examination that was introduced for the first time. So what was your strategy for each and every subject that you opted in CUET? Uh, for English, it was like, it's a subject that we always have to have in our hand. It's not a subject in fact. There was a teacher who used to tell us that it's actually a skill set. So I think it's like a constant building upon the language. Uh, even the paper was not that difficult, if I may say. It's like antonyms, synonyms and all. So a brief brush through, in fact, was my strategy. For political science, sociology and psychology, it was basic NCRT books. And I believe they are the Bibles for all these subjects. Uh, constant MCQ solving is the ma major thing that I did. Since assertion and reasoning and all did not come in CUET, I just left that part over. Rest, it's the same. It's NCRT, basically. It was hard. Initially, it was very hard because we have to get into a way, learn about MCQs, learn how to solve them. You know, it was a different strategy. So that is actually a problem. So I was intimidated at the very beginning and later I consulted all of my teachers and they actually gave me certain steps to, uh, what do you call it, crack the exam, crack the board exam basically. I was able to practice a lot of MCQs. My teachers were very helpful in providing a lot of MCQ questions and that is basically how I cracked MCQs. And when it came into CUAT, since it was the same uh, strategy, you know, since it was the same, what do you call it, the uh, way of examination, I was able to uh, cope up with it pretty much. Easy. Okay. One more question I have. Students are very confused whether to start the examination preparation before boards or after. My personal strategy was going on with uh, the goal of writing CUAT as well as the board exam all together. Because since our portions are similar or it's the same, it's very easy for us to handle both of them. We don't have to learn extra. As of now, in my year, we didn't have to learn extra. So it was like taking both of them together and having a knack on both of them, I think is the best strategy that you could follow. All right, wonderful. So you said you are studying at Lady Sri Ram, which is one of the top colleges in DU. Was this your first preference? Yeah, it was always my first preference to study in LSR. That was my college. How are you liking the college so far? I am loving it. In fact, in the beginning, it was very intimidating to see a lot of people who are at their best of their, what you call, talents and passions and stuff. But now I feel I'm, I'm trying to uh, understand what is happening around me and I feel I belong over here. Okay, that's wonderful to know. Congratulations on that. Mm -hmm. All right, the last question I want you to tell us about, what would be some of the general tips that you would want to give to the students who are watching us, who will prepare for the exam and appear next year. The initial step is that, as I said earlier, NCRT is your Bible. Go through it as much as you can. Try understanding the concepts, that's very important. Because it's MCQ, you won't be able to uh, write by heart at you. You have to learn the concepts properly, understand your fundamentals. Second is that, I didn't basically solve uh, mock tests and all that. but. I believe solving mock tests is a very good idea. Thank you so much. It was wonderful to talk Thank to you. And I'm sure it will help a lot of students out there. Thank you. Thank you.